Hi, today I'd like to show you the movement of the anhydro here in this very beautiful and rare natural. It's an anhydro, but it's also a Brandberg crystal that's clustered here together. As you can see, it's right there where my thumbnail is at, the anhydro bubble. Not only is it kind of small, but it's very kind of far deep back here within the crystal. Sometimes it's very hard to see and find, but when I safely and carefully turn the crystal, there you go. Did you just see the movement of the anhydro right in there? There we go. And the water that's inside of here, now this is regarded as extremely pure, having never been touched before by human hands ever. And also this crystal is 28 grams. And you can see that this is clustered here. This also has a bridge or an inner child crystal. And this does have tiny little rainbows in certain areas. Even though the rainbows, they're not always visible. Let me show you if I can get the light to reflect off of the crystal at just the right angle here. You can see where the little rainbows are like right here in this area. And they're small and not always visible, but this still does possess the metaphysical properties of the rainbow crystal, just so everyone knows and is aware of that. And throughout this video, you may be able to see some of the rainbows a bit better as I'm making this video, just so everyone knows and is aware. And also, it's very faint and normally very hard to see, but they do a, uh, well, I don't know if all of the Brandberg crystals do, but this one right here, it has a very faint phantom, if you can see. Looks like the shape of an upside down V. If you can see, it's far back within the crystal. There you go, if you can see it right there. It's right there. There we go. So it does have a phantom right there, if you can see. Let me turn this over to show you. And some individuals, they may consider this to be self-healed, and not all self-healed crystals look the same because they have different processes within their growth patterning. And before I get started, though, on a lot of the different metaphysical properties, I wanted to make sure I'm able to show you that if you can notice here, even though this is considered very rare, because this is clustered together here, and this is an anhydro crystal. Oh, look at that beautiful rainbow. I just saw the way how the light reflected off the crystal. I don't know if you can see that right in there. It was such a beautiful rainbow right there. But this does have some natural like markings and nicks, some scratches, chips, some holes, imprints. Even this has like indentations also. And that's because it's taken this type of crystal a very long time to grow and form in nature. And when this crystal was growing and forming in nature in close proximity to the other crystals in nature, and you know it can take crystals a while to grow and form, so they do have plenty of time where they can like poke and scratch each other. That's what they've done here. You can see it like on the point and on the faces and actually on the entire uh, body of these crystals and on the points you can see where it has the natural like markings and nicks scratches chips holes imprints and indentations even the contact markings and this is all just naturally occurring in nature it's part of the very long beautiful growth process i just wanted to make sure that everyone knows and is aware of that and also, it's very windy out here right now, and I truly do apologize about the wind, and I hope that everyone is still able to hear me okay. I'm not sure if I'll make a long video because of the wind. But I do uh, want to talk about some of the metaphysical properties of this very beautiful and rare natural crystal. And it's also reported that no matter uh, what color that a Brandberg crystal is, that it's reported to have all of the metaphysical properties of an amethyst, a clear, and a smoky quartz crystal, just so everyone knows and is aware of that as well. And this does have some beautiful transparency in certain areas. 
and within different types of crystal healing sessions and meditation techniques. Now this is a crystal that's reported to be like a catalyst for great and major changes to happen within your life. And us as humans, we have water within us and this crystal is an anhydro crystal and it's reported that we share a very profound connection with an anhydro crystal. This is reported also uh, to be associated, water is, with, uh, with life and with birth, with renewal and also with emotions and this is reported to be incredibly beneficial for emotional healing, emotional balance, emotional strength and also for emotional maturity. You can see the rainbow right in there. This may help you to make better decisions within your life. An amethyst is a stone of attraction and the all-purpose healer. This is also called nature's tranquilizer. This is very calming, very healing, grounding, balancing, nurturing, supportive, inspirational, very spiritual, and also very protective, this crystal. A lot of individuals, they call this an amulet of protection. And this may help to guard and protect you and your loved ones, even your home, your property, and also your belongings. It's reported that having this crystal with you is like having a, a white light of love and protection just wrapped around you. This crystal may also help you with ascension and on your journey to enlightenment. And this crystal is also called the crystal of the angels and this may help you to facilitate communications with angels and spirit guides. And this may help you to access and feel their love, their guidance, their wisdom and their protection. And not just the angels and the spirit guides, but also the archangels with nature spirits and elementals, even goddesses, water divas. Look at that beautiful rainbow right in there. Even ghosts and orbs, the earth and minerals with beings of energy, beings of light. Also guardians and spiritual teachers, ascended masters. Also with the trees and insects and fairies. And also this is reported to be very beneficial to help you uh, to facilitate communications with beings from other realities and dimensions. And as a stone of attraction, this is reported that this is uh, very beneficial to help you to attract the energies that's needed to attract like your soulmate and more loving, high vibrational, positive types of energies into your life. This is also reported to be very beneficial to gift to your crush, to let them know that you're ready for like love, devotion, and commitment. This may help to heal relationships and friendships. And this may also uh, be very beneficial for family relationships and also for a business relationship, individuals have reported. This may help with empathy, with kindness, with patience and acceptance, forgiveness, stability, self-love. Also, this may help uh, with reconciliation. And I've even had individuals report that this may help with marital fidelity. I've had a few individuals report that this may help you to reunite lost loves. And this crystal is also reported to be very beneficial to help with meditation. This may help you to achieve deeper meditative states. This is also reported to help with dream work, angel work, light work, grid work, body healing layouts, even group spiritual work and multidimensional healing. This may help you with self-healing, soul healing, and even karmic cleansing. This may help you with psychic protection and protection during ceremonial work, spells, and even protection during uh, rituals. This may help you with banishing rituals, moon rituals, even rainbow goddess rituals. This is reported to be incredibly beneficial for planetary healing and earth healing. And this may help to ground you to Mother Gaia and even bond you closer to Mother Earth and Mother Nature, individuals have reported. And this may also help plants and gardens to grow and flourish. This may be beneficial for Reiki, even Feng Shui, Wicca, Paganism, Buddhism. This is also reported to help to guide soul safely to the other side. 
turn a bit better here. This is reported incredibly beneficial also to help you to get rid of like negative evil energies and unwanted energy attachments, even lower level entities. This may help you with astral uh, projection and astral travel assistance, even past life healing assistance. And this may also help you to promote and provide a direct link to the Akashic Record. And this may help you to access ancient wisdom and future knowledge. This is reported to be very like healing, cleansing, purifying, and protective for your auras. And this may also help to like harmonize stabilize and repair your auric fields and individuals they've also reported that this may help you to like open and activate cleanse harmonize balance re-energize realign and that this can just work with all of the chakras and this is a master healing quartz crystal and this may help you to heal through almost any ailment or illness that is affecting you individuals have reported and with the same type of mineral though different individuals they report different types of properties I've had individuals report this is very beneficial to help heal issues related to the heart both physically and emotionally this may help with some blood diseases and disorders and this may also help within some cancer and radiation treatments this is reported to be like an all-purpose healing crystal this may help to alleviate some swellings and this is reported to be like a natural antiviral and anti-inflammatory this may help the brain and the thymus. This may help with brain uh, tissue uh, strengthening, individuals have reported. This may also help the spine and facet joint pain, and this may help the digestive system. This may help you to alleviate some cramps, and this may help the liver. This may help the skeletal system, and this may help your bones to heal. And this is also reported to be very beneficial if you have any problems with like arthritis, lordosis, arthrosis, rheumatism, fibromyalgia, osteoporosis and also uh, with gout this may help and be beneficial for individuals have reported this is also reported to help if you have problems with like your ankles and your feet your knees your hips even your hands your eyes your ears your nose and your throat and this may help if you have problems with like your kidneys your bladder your gallbladder your pancreas your spleen and your thyroid this may help you to stimulate and strengthen the pineal, the pituitary, and the endocrine gland. This may also help you to stimulate the immune system and promote cellular regeneration, and that's for a speedy recovery when you're not feeling well. And this may help your uh, respiratory system and your lungs. This may help if you have problems with like your muscles, nerves, tissues, and ligaments within the body, and this may also help you to alleviate some headaches. This may help with some uh, skin conditions individuals have reported. I've even had individuals report that this may help within some uh, treatments of HIV and AIDS. This may help you to stimulate and strengthen the immune system. And this may also help you to promote cellular regeneration. And that is for a speedy recovery when you're not feeling well. This is reported to be very beneficial to help heal the body in so many different ways. And this may help you with pain relief and stress relief. This is also reported to be beneficial to help you to get rid of toxins from the body and remove those. And this may help you also uh, to remove and reduce addiction from your life. Different individuals, they report different types of addictions. That This may help with like some food addiction, drug addiction, sex addiction. This may help you to not want to smoke or even drink that much. Individuals reported, a few of them have. This may also help you to alleviate some of the feelings that's associated with withdrawal detoxification and addiction feelings such as like agitation anger aggression bitterness hopelessness fears depression sorrow sadness shame guilt and resentment this may help you to remove and reduce those feelings if you're experiencing that and this may help you to overcome heartache and trauma within this life and also your past lives this is reported to be very beneficial the energies that's radiating from this if you were to keep this very safely and carefully near your work environment or like a healing treatment space, that this may help you to increase and improve your mental clarity, your mental health and your wisdom. This may help your focus, your concentration. This may help your leadership abilities and skills also individuals have reported. 
This may also help your uh, learning abilities, your problem solving skills, your communication skills and listening skills. This is reported to be very beneficial to help to increase your creative energies and this may help you with the expansion of your imagination and also the expansion of your consciousness. And this may help to raise your vibrations and the vibrations of the earth. This is also reported to be very beneficial to help to increase your energy, which may help your work productivity. This may help to bond you closer to co-workers and colleagues, also individuals have reported. This may help to increase your self-confidence, your self-esteem, your courage, and your bravery. This may help you to get rid of your shyness also. This may help you to make uh, better decisions and accomplish your dreams and your goals. This is also reported to be very beneficial to help uh, when you're working with your shadow self. This may help you with inner child healing also. And this may help to like balance the male and the female energies, balance meridians, and also the yin and yang elements individuals have reported. This is also reported to be very beneficial if you're experiencing any problems with sleep issues. This may help you to have more peaceful and restful sleep. And this is reported very beneficial to help to get rid of like bad dreams and nightmares. This may also help with insomnia and lucid dreaming. This may also help you to remember your dreams from spirit guides and loved ones who've crossed over. And this is regarded uh, very beneficial to help to clear negative energies from houses and areas. And this does emit so much divine love and positive energy. This may help you to attract good luck, love, wealth, good health, prosperity, positivity, balance, harmony, joy, unity, even uh, more abundance to your life. This is reported to be a conduit for more love and light to enter into your being also. This is also reported to be very beneficial to help you to manifest your deepest wants and desires into reality. And this may also help you to amplify energy and intentions. This is also reported very beneficial to help you to increase and improve your psychic abilities. And this may help you with different abilities such as like clairaudience and clairvoyance, ESP, intuition, scrying, gazing, channeling, psychometry, precognition, psychic visions, telepathy, prophecy, divination. This may also help when you're working with uh, past and future realities and portal work and even chanting and when you're in a drum circle. Even automatic writing individuals have reported this beneficial for. And different individuals, they're reporting different types of abilities over different time spans, just so everyone knows and is aware of that. This is also a crystal that's reported to be beneficial to help you when you're going through, like, sorrow, through, like, loss of a loved one. And this may help to encourage you to understand that we are all made up of energy, and energy cannot die, only merely transform. This is reported very beneficial for spiritual growth and guidance spiritual protection and progression with spiritual healings spiritual cleansing and even individuals have reported this beneficial for spiritual awakenings and this may help you to reclaim any missing or lost soul fragments this may also help to like cleanse uh, your environment and cleanse other crystals and even to cleanse yourself if you go to www.etsy which is spelled etsy.com backslash sublime soul gifts and that's all one word and that is spelled s-u-b-l-i-m-e s-o-u-l g-i-f-t-s now i'll have a lot more pictures of this beautiful and rare natural crystal not just the pictures though but i'm also going to have a lot more information if you'd like to learn more on how this can help you since i've only touched base on just a few of the metaphysical properties here and this does offer a lot more metaphysical properties also. This is also reported to be beneficial to help to alleviate like depression. Individuals they've reported this is very beneficial to help to remove like panic, anxiety, and stress. This may help to calm you down if you've had a very stressful day also individuals have reported. This is reported to help to balance out anything that this has placed near. And this does offer a lot more properties. I just wanted to touch base on a few of them. 
and also the marker has started to come off. I'm definitely going to remark where the anhydra is located, so hopefully you're able to see it and find it a bit easier. Even though it is hard, it's kind of a small anhydra, and it's very far back within the crystal. So I find it easier to view, personally, with uh, proper backlighting and also with magnification. But sometimes it's very hard to see and find, just so everyone knows and is aware of that. And this is a crystal that may help you to feel better like mentally and physically, spiritually and emotionally. And I appreciate everyone. Thank you so much for taking the time to view this video. And remember, this does offer a lot more metaphysical properties. I just wanted to touch base on a few of them here. And I truly do appreciate everyone. I hope that everyone has very beautiful and wonderful day. Thanks.